Hi, my beautiful souls. This is your soul family, Sa. I am here ready to talk to you today about the star seeds. Let's talk about the star seeds. Who are they? This is a very amazing, beautiful topic for me to talk about because I am one. <laughs> okay. All right, my soul family. Let's talk about the star seeds and let's see if you are one too. Okay. Star seeds are souls that have lived life many lifetimes before this one in planets over, I won't say overseas, over the galaxies, all right, over the galaxies. So different planets, different places, and it's not like <clears throat> they just lived on Earth. So every soul is different in this life. In this life in this lifetime every soul is different you are extremely unique no one else is like you <laughs> that's a confirmation you are extremely unique and I want you to know that and remember how unique you are okay you are amazing okay even if nobody told you or you heard it before I just want you to know how awesome you are because you're extremely unique you were created not just in an image of the Creator like when I don't follow a certain religious system all right so when I say oh you're created in an image of Creator I'm not just I'm not embodying Christianity or anything like that okay I'm all into the mind science all right so listen to me you're extremely unique there is this source energy within you it's operating everything for you all right your whole body you don't even know how your cells function or why okay you're just being okay and it's beautiful okay you're very unique now when we come to your soul essence and i say it's soul because in english you grab it better okay in truth you're not even a soul but i'm trying to deliver a message to you your soul energy it enters and it embodies your physical form this is physical all right so your soul energy or the energy that comes through you that operates this and functions your whole being this energy your energy signature okay is unique no one else is like you no one else is like you trust me all right you are extremely unique okay everybody is unique okay so they are energy systems walking around us now in this day and time and they come from different places they didn't come from earth of course they might have had a lifetime in earth like they are right now okay and they're extremely beautiful too <laughs> not just physically but physically they are all right hear me out hear me out star seed okay uh, maybe some they're not okay but stars shines all right stars in galaxies they shine okay in the night sky you see them as light okay so if you have that embodiment that signature of energy within you you are a light not just for yourself no you're a light for those around you okay so my beloveds, let's talk about the star seeds. And we are, <laughs> we are definitely talking about the star seeds. All right, they are a signature of energy embodiment in this time space reality, okay? They embody the physical form of humans, but they're not really from the earth, okay? They've lived in earth probably most likely before, but this time, a lot of them are finalizing their contracts all right finalizing their life mission this is it <laughs> i am channeling so sorry guys because it just makes me laugh because it's funny it's funny because you know michael jackson last album was this is it so the Illuminati always will throw you signals, left, right, and center. Listen up, all right? 
This group of people, starseed, they're born from different planets, different stars in the galaxies. And there are certain planets that are known to human, but I don't think everything is known. If you want to find out if you're a starseed or not, usually you're born with a huge high intuition. You would just know. All right. Otherwise, I always advise and suggest people to get their uh, birth chart done. All right. Um, I don't do them. You'll have to find someone. I know someone. If you contact me privately, I'll let you know. And um, they just need your time of birth with the date and the place. And through the birth chart, they will tell you if you are a star seed or not. And if you are, which planet did you come from and how many incarnation you have had in that planet okay so star seed is a very complex topic because hi this is going to be on youtube so everybody's awareness is different there are so many people who walk the earth right now pretending pretending this is their first time here all right and well they're not pretending but they're not extremely awake so when we say star seeds, it doesn't mean they have had only one life. They're very unique, okay? They had multiple lives in different galaxies. Maybe some of them have had multiple lives in multiple galaxies, multiple places, stars, okay? And listen to me, the human age number is extremely small comparing to other beings, okay? comparing to other beings. Other beings have a very huge long numbers comparing to humans. And humans were not always with short age lifespan. No, they were first, they had really long lifespans. And then humans somehow, they're very creative in destructing their own and shorten their own life with their own behaviors sometime, you know? And that includes how you take care of the vessel of your body. But anyways, in a lot of religious texts, I'm very spiritual, but I love to read. In a lot of like religious texts, they talked about Adam and the people of Adam, how before they were much, much giants. They were taller, they lived 300 years and stuff like that. So humans have gone through evolution, all right? Um, star seeds their life in other planets the the age is completely different from human form they have like hundreds and hundreds of years in one planet and then the other like now in earth it's different okay because now in earth you you will be lucky if you get like 130 years old maybe more I don't know <laughs> but humans are also transforming so that will be different in the future okay back to topic back to topic star seeds how do you know you are a star seed if you feel a sense of isolation like from the world if you feel like you don't belong here you don't like it here it sucks here. how would you uh feel if you are a star seed you would definitely 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 always had this feeling that you are not from here maybe you're missing home and you cannot put your hands on where home is maybe you you know where home is but you, you know it's not here physically speaking okay you will also feel like the sense of non-belonging okay not constantly this comes and go guys because uh, star seeds are very bright and they always do energy work whether they realize it or not so their energy it shifts you know it's like roller coaster but you would definitely feel the sense of uh, you don't like it here you don't like this place <laughs> um, and yeah a sense of isolation loneliness you, you don't feel like you can really relate with others very easily um, another way is your intuition. Your intuition will be extremely high. You will have um, also um, a loving for the stars, like whether it's star science or just the view of the stars um, or just loving the, the dark sky, you know, with the stars. Um, you'll have relation to that. A lot of uh, star seed will see their past lives in dream state. All right, maybe even in meditation state upon awakening, 
okay because that happened to me um both states actually so once like a star seed comes to this plane in a human form and is born that connection to the star planet that the star seed has it gets activated okay so you are always in contact with your star planet and your star people and you are in contact with star with other star seeds without you realizing you know and when the time is right you will see them in physical form but everything is interconnected everything is so you are interconnected with your past lives and it is dormant in this lifetime and when you need it that energy comes out okay but overall you embody the energy of your star past lives and you are here for a mission so let's talk if you are a star seed what's up what's your mission okay your mission a star seed based on the planet that you came from every planet has a different mission but mostly i will say the collective mission is to shift the consciousness of humanity okay to shift the consciousness of humanity as they are like uh, light they bring more light to the earth and they're born here because this is the times of uh, the great great shift massive shift the age of the aquarius is um uh, it's it's shifting now a lot of people said it had started intuitively what i have picked it's gonna start at 2027 and we're going through the shift now and the shift is really not easy <laughs> it's not a pleasant shift anyways uh the mission of the star seed is to bring so much light to humanity to shift their consciousness into the consciousness of oneness and love and um each and everyone is uniquely unique so they will do it uniquely different you know uniquely different so i hope you enjoyed this topic i love star seeds and they are all about love and more love and they're very higher vibrational beings and as i said they have so much light within them and it's written all over their energy so yeah if you want to know your one i don't know you might already know but if you really want to dig deep into it get your birth chart laid out for you okay all right guys thank you for watching comments share and if you haven't subscribed and if you have good we're gonna meet again all right okay see you goodbye